Welcome, Wildcats, to Create Your Own Color Wheel with Julie Graham. Miss Graham, that's who I am. Uh, just checking on you guys and hoping that you are able to follow the directions. Uh, they're found in your Canvas account, and also you've had emails sent to your parents. So first things first, what you need to do is find something either that's a circle or you can actually take and make a circle on your paper with something I chose this paper plate uh, it's a little awkward at first but I got the hang of it your first job first step is to use a ruler or something with a straight edge and divide this circle in half vertically The next step is that you're going to now take a ruler or a straight edge and you've got your vertical line. Now you're going to create a horizontal line so that you will have four equal shapes. Now this next section is a little bit different. This part is a little trickier. You're going to divide each of the quarters that you just had. Here's your vertical line, here's your horizontal line, and you're going to divide the quarter into three even slices. What I found helpful is to first place a dot, making sure that these dots are spaced out evenly. Then you connect the dots running through the center here so that you'll have even lines just like a bike wheel. Vertical, horizontal, and now you're going to do this. You have one, two, three. You're going to have a total of 12 separate lines when you're finished. So this is what it looks like. You're going to then mark each section with the color. You want to use a pencil first because, of course, that gives you a chance if you need to correct it, you can correct it. But if you'll notice, it's going to definitely have your Roy G. Biv order. So here you have red, then you're going to have red orange, you have orange, then you're going to have orange yellow, yellow, yellow green, green. Here's blue green. Now this is indigo, which is the same color for blue. So you've got indigo blue, blue violet, violet, and then here's red violet. That's really all you have to try to get accomplished by today, uh, Tuesday, if you're able to. You're definitely not required to sit and work on this all at one time. Space it out over the week. It's not due to be finished until Friday. The big thing you needed to do is spend some time thinking about how do you want to decorate this color wheel. You have lots of choices here. You can come in and use any kind of color medium that you have. You might have crayons. You might have color pencils. You might have paint. You might have, uh, you could either have watercolor paint or you could have acrylic paint. Um, anything you want to do. So let me show you the step I took. I chose this color wheel. Uh, I chose to do the painting. So I've got my combinations of color. What I did discover is it's a lot easier for you to paint and get your design on there first and then create your design. And I thought you might like seeing what I was going to do with that. So I've got that going. What I was going to also do is, hold on here, let me show you. I was going to come in here and do lines like this.
and I'm just using a Sharpie just because I have one. You don't have to use a Sharpie. You can use a pen or you can use maybe one of the darker colors that you have available. Be creative with your choices because you do not have to make it look just like mine. You can definitely make it your own way. In fact, uh, one student already showed me that they did it like a flower with different shades of the different colors. But you can see that you can definitely decorate this um, with, with uh, a design. Or if you'd like, you could do a collage where you cut little pieces of paper and you glue them on here. So the big important part is that you have a choice to do it either way. Do your best to find the assignment in your Canvas account if you can. If not, you can just follow along with this video and do the best you can. And I hope you have a really good time with that. Uh, that's all. Have a great rest of your week. Bye for now, you guys. Signing out.